I think it's a good matchup. I think it's going to be a good fight. Jamie definitely comes to scrap, and I'm definitely coming, and I have a point to prove, and I need to prove that I belong here, and I know I belong here, and so I'm just ready to show everybody what I can do. I've been working my boxing a lot, so I'm ready to hit those angles. I know she's a little bit taller. Um, I got a long reach, though, so um, I'm ready to go in there and throw my hands, see my opportunities, and just be an opportuni opportunistic fighter. So whatever comes, I'm gonna see it. I'm just gonna be focused. I'm gonna go with it. And um, if I see my takedowns, I'll take them. Um, but I'm looking for my openings, looking for some body shots, looking to put some hard punches in her face and, and test her will. I've watched Jamie fight since she was Invicta, and I've always, you know, kind of kept track of her. And I just always thought she was a good fighter, and I liked watching her fight. And so I'm excited to fight, have the opportunity to fight her. What are you looking for? Uh, I just want to really show my stand-up, I want to show my wrestling, I just want to show like I'm a complete MMA fighter, I don't have any weaknesses everywhere, I just want to show everybody what I do in the gym. I was just looking for new looks and different perspectives, different coaches, um, different training partners, uh, everything that I had in Las Vegas was really great, but um, at Team Alpha Male I've got like a new boxing coach, which is, which is something that I feel like has really uh, helped my game, and also just a lot more variety with training partners, everybody that's in the same mindset of wanting to be champion, wanting to be in the UFC, wanting to be the best fighters that they can be, um, so just the environment uh, that I'm in now is, is uh, I feel like more intense on a higher level and um, the level of training partners and uh, coaches that I'm, I'm getting at Team Alpha Male is just on a, on a higher level and there's so much more of it so it's, it's really amazing. Obviously, like your debut, you know, it didn't go the way you wanted. So, what have you? What did you do right after that? And how did you get back into the gym and slow? Uh, I cried a lot for like two days. <laughs> <laughs> and then I just got right back into the gym. Uh, my coach did pass two weeks after that, so then kind of dealing with all of that. And uh, so uh, I think just kind of just owing it to Fallis, just getting back in there. I know that's what he would have wanted. And just, you know, you can't stay out of the gym and dwell on a loss. The best way to get over a loss is get right back in there. The best way to get over a loss is to have a good practice and then another good practice and then another good practice. And then you just are able to remind yourself that you are good, that that loss doesn't define who you are. Are and just to move on from it. I'm just wondering, like, how much work is passing like, something that kind of helped bring you guys together and try to be a part of executing his philosophies? I think a lot of us just felt like we owed it to him. Like, it, he really tried to help with, like, the mental side of things. And, like, he was just always trying to reassure us that we do have all the tools and we, like, can go in there and perform, like, the way we want to. And I feel like it would just be, like, a big disservice to him and his legacy if we let any of those little things get into our head and, like, play a factor in that. Uh, he helped so much. I actually went home after his passing to go to his memorial up there because we're from the same area in Oregon. And uh, I was able to kind of reconnect with my mom and let go of a lot of stuff that I didn't really know I was holding on to her and like just really like it, it was kind of weird like the conclusion of his death like I found all the answers that I feel like he was trying to show me like during like my all my time I spent with him so it was uh, kind of an odd uh, way to come out of it I feel like a lot of people maybe would have like you know really like had a problem like fighting again after that but Kevin Tim everyone like came out and fought really well after that so I'm ready to do the same as that